Hello, Superheard, and welcome back to Splatoon 2. And today we're actually doing something pretty darn special. We're gonna be having a bonus episode of the story mode. Now, one thing that you guys have been letting me know and that you would really like to see is that apparently if you do the final boss of the game a second time, things are a little bit different. Not significantly different, but it approaches the boss fight in the context that we had already completed the first one. So things are a little bit different. So I figured since you guys wanted me to show it off, I will go ahead and do so. So we're gonna go ahead and move all the way over here to the final boss fight, bomb, rush, blush, tide goes out. So let's go ahead and give that a shot and hopefully everything works well. You know, I struggled on the final boss in the series, so hopefully I do a little bit better this time. But it does give me the opportunity to say thank you guys so much for supporting this series so far. It's been so much fun. And I just I can't wait to keep going. Uh, you know, I recorded the entire story mode before the game even came out, so I haven't really, at that point, I didn't see your guys' responses to the story mode videos, to the online mode videos, and now that I've seen that, it's just so much fun. I've been posting two Splatoon videos a day, and I just I just love the game. You guys seem to be really enjoying the episodes. But uh, for right now, mess them up, Agent 4. Wait, seriously? Why are you here, Kelly? We already rescued you. You're just in time for the encore performance. What? Why would you put those stupid brainwashing sunglasses back on? They look good on me, okay? <laughs> no one throws shade at my shades and gets away with it. Shade at my shades. Hey, DJ! Oh my gosh, and how did Octavio get out? Maybe she really should have cooked him up and ate him. If this is what he's gonna do. <sighs> These two, and they got the Zapfish bag? <laughs> they were quick. Oh my gosh, who needs a Splatoon 3 when they work this quickly, they can just do it within Splatoon 2. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I re-remix Gally's brain, and now I'm gonna remix your face! Okay, let's hit him with our hit single, Bomb Rush Blush. Peep this. Okay, so the boss fight itself is the same, but all the context should be a little bit different. Oh, I just love these shades, they're so fresh. <laughs> she really, she doesn't mind getting brainwashed as long as she, <laughs> as long as she gets to keep the cool, fashionable shades. That's a little silly, don't you think, Kelly? We gotta avoid the spinning punches. I know, I know, don't worry about it, Sheldon. I've done this before. And then I think, yep, it seems like all of this is just about the same that actually broke my armor there. Okay, so that's a spinning punch. And hopefully I can do this boss fight first try. I'm gonna be a little disappointed, disappointed in myself if I don't, because I've already done the boss fight and I've gotten a lot more Splatoon practice, even though this is my first time playing Splatoon today. Okay, uh, let's back up. And then, Okay, here we go, I can hit this one. Oh, boom, and then go and get this one as well. Nice, okay, we're doing a decent first round, but it is just the first round, so we got a lot more to go. And then you're not a spinning fist, so I can't get you. Get out of here, taco fist. Oh, oh darn, I got it, I let it go a little too close. Turn him into calamari, I'd rather you not. Uh, dodge, okay, I know I am, don't worry, don't worry. Oh, it's just so tough because I'm trying to read what they're saying to see what the text is different. And in that act, I'm sort of messing up a little bit. All right, so let's go ahead and start getting you like that, and then get you. Nice stuff, so we're doing some good damage to him. All right, I think I have a couple seconds to breathe. Actually, I don't too much. All right, I'm not gonna be able to get this one, am I? Nope, that's okay, I can just go ahead and attack him. Good start, we only gotta hit once, right, with our armor? Hey, no fair! Hmm, this fight reminds me of a certain Splatfest. Oh! <laughs> Shut it, Grandma, Grandma! DJ, dubstep, dubstep your game up. Was that, 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 that line definitely was not in there. The Splatfest line was not in the first one. That digs deep. Oh, ho, ho, ho. I wonder if the Splatfest results were different, would the story mode be different in this one? I wonder if they decided the story mode based on who won the Splatfest. That'd be weird. I think they you know, probably decided based on the characters' things. Oh, it's his calamari, calamari bomb things. Oh, oh, I, sh I should have been paying attention. I was trying to read the text once again. Maybe I should just not worry about it once in game. Okay, so I don't need to worry about that one too much. This one is not a spinning one, so let's go ahead and take care of that. And still a challenging boss fight. I like how they have the time on the top. Now, I don't think they did that the first time, but you know, now they assume that people are playing it again, they're obviously gonna be doing it for speedrun purposes. So they just put the time on the top, very good. Okay, so I might actually wanna like skedaddle over this way, just so that he's not really focused on hitting me over there. It might be the better strategy here. Yuck! Okay, we're doing good. I'm on my way, Agent 4, just keep hitting him. Okay, so you're gonna be throwing, oh no, you're moving, you're moving quick. Let's throw a bomb over that way, fill up my ink as much as I can. We're doing okay, I did get hit that one time. Seems like it's mandatory for me to get hit at least once, right? Okay, so I can hit you, 
Boom, 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 boom. Switch right to you, and will that be enough? Oh, it will, okay, good, good, good. Fun to this fool. I love the extra fourth wall breaking texts for the most part. So let's see if this is any different. I'm here, again. Hey, oh, how you doing? <laughs> this scene is cool, so it's good to rewatch it. Oh, oof, those shades, you gotta break those. Not again, the hypno shades! Callie, forget about those stupid sunglasses. Oh, oh boy. Now Agent 4, with Ke while, while Kelly is stunned, and DJ Octavio's career. I'm gonna end this man's whole career. God, double time, more beatdowns per minute. Uh, okay, dash punch, yada yada. <laughs> I think she knows how we do this because we've already beaten this boss before. Okay, so let's do what we can. This is so cool though, I'm really glad that we uh, are redoing this just because it's a fun little thing. So that's not a spinning punch, so I can go ahead and take that one out. I'm gonna try to skedaddle on over here so we're just not in the, you know, range of this stuff. Oh, here it goes, here it goes. Boom, that's a spinning one, so we're gonna move out of the way of that, and then we're doing okay, we're doing okay. But this is the last time until we move into the next section. Oh yeah, not even gonna deal with it. Not even gonna deal with it. Ooh, that's a spinning fist. Oh, where are you? Oh, there you are! Oh, darn it, I almost got it, but not quite. Okay, he's about to, oh, throw his double fist, but, oh, almost got it. So a lot of people were saying they want to see DJ Octavio in the suit here, um, in arms, because it does sort of make sense, because, you know, he's throwing out these arms that have, I think, chains on them. Obviously, they can't be springs, because Springman's got that. Um, but that would actually be pretty cool. Oh, you know what, Ninjara has chains, actually, so that wouldn't be good either. But they are chains. Actually, they're not. They sort of look like their own thing. But it would be weird to see DJ Octavio in arms and I really don't expect it. Hey, you never know. Okay, so he's taking quite the beating, but he seems to be, you know, used to that. I mean, this will be the third time in the storyline, technically, in this situation, but I'm pretty sure this last boss fight isn't very canon. You know, seeing how they're mentioning Splatfest and stuff. Okay, so that's the spinning. And then this should be a normal one. It is. Is this gonna be the last one? It is! Nice! Puree this punk. Got him. So now we're moving on to the next section. Oh, you got me, you got ink right in my eye. The low tide ink is working. Kelly's coming too. Ooh. Kelly, remember! Oh, the world's reflected in our songs. Yeah, this is definitely different. And her songs are reflected in the world. I, I remember. Yay, she's back, I'm back! <laughs> Of course, this part, the song itself is the same. But the text speeches were definitely, uh, that's, this is the same. The Squid Sisters are back! I love this part though. It's such a cool, like, cinematic boss fight. The boss fight itself is pretty similar to the first game, but overall it's good. And then we get this, of course, which is still super duper cool. The Rainmaker, Asian Foil, this is a super modded Rainmaker, and no, yep, 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 we know, we know. So now we gotta go ahead and shoot you in the face! Not quite. Well, we just gotta wait for this right here. Look, I know you DJs recycle old content for a living. Oh, but at least get some new material. I don't know if, that, I, I'm pretty sure that wasn't said in the first game, right? That couldn't have been. That was so much shade. I was supposed to hit that, by the way. I was supposed to jump over the spinning ones like that. And then I just, yeah, I messed it up. But I won't this time. Oh, okay, I did it. So far, I haven't taken a hit. Boom, nice, that was good, that was good. But yeah, that's just so crazy. So much shade being thrown there. DJs recycle stuff for a living. I guess it's a sort of a commentary on modern day pop music. I don't listen to the radio either. It gets really repetitive. Like local radio stations are just, I don't know. I don't like them. Because they just usually play the same songs on like loop for like several hours. It's just like, ugh. I would hate having that job. Because it would just sound so boring. Wow, they actually got me with that. I thought I jumped clear over that, but okay. You say so. Let's try that again. Okay, so, yep. Get you, uh, thank you. Okay, we're doing a better start this time. If you can't deflate the, the jump, the punch, jump over it. I know, I know. I know what to do. Apparently I just don't know how to do it well. All right, that's gonna be one we can attack like that and then jump, just in case. Okay, we're doing better this time, but we gotta do, you know, consistently better or we're just gonna end up dying again. That's all you're supposed to do. Boom, hit that, jump over just in case, because that's what hit me last time was a normal punch. It's gonna be a spinning one, or what? It actually isn't. Usually they do, you know, normal spin, normal spin. Oh, I jumped way too soon for that one. Come on, that's gonna be, <laughs> okay. Yeah, not a problem, not a problem. 
Normal punch. I'm gonna jump over here just really quickly, then maybe jump back over here. And Blog, splash you, squid sisters. I can't resist your poppy groove. That's That was a uh, different text than last time. It wasn't poppy groove, I don't think. I mean, maybe it wasn't. I'm just misremembering that too. I don't know. I'm just trying to not die, because it's not fun to die. Come on, he has to be low. He's all like red explosions in the background of his uh, lighting effects. Oh gosh. Oh, we did it! I think? No? No, not quite. Jump! I had the itch my nose. Awful, awful timing. Come on. What you got? What you got? Not that! Oh boy. Come on, this has to be the last one. I'm pretty sure we're close. Boom! It was! There he goes! See ya, DJ! For the millionth time. Move to the inner, inner ride rail. Okay. Ooh. Can I shoot at him? I can't quite. Oh, I can! That almost landed on him. Now jump and finish him up! Boom! Okay. Still a great boss fight, but I'm glad we did it. Differently this time. Or at least I guess we did it the same. Again. So sad. Cross fade to black. Okay. That was good. That was fun. I'm glad to see there was some mix ups there. It's probably gonna be a short episode today, because I would have just wanted to show off that little extra bent. But hey, we did it! <laughs> okay, we destroyed all of it. I'm glad to see. Does he, like, I wonder if anything else is different from here on out? I'm gonna guess no, but hey, look at that. We got a little fake zap fish because we already got the zap fish for this level. It is this guy. <laughs> okay, cool. Actually, I don't think we got a zap fish the first time we completed this boss fight. It just cut the black. So it's weird that it did it this time. Yeah, it definitely didn't show that at all before. So we get to see what the fake Zapfish looks like. We didn't get to see that throughout the uh, series because I've always done all the levels on the first try. And if I didn't, I would restart it. So very cool. That is what it looks like there. If we go back to uh, the menu now, I don't think anything will change. Which is worth checking out. Maybe there will be something a little bit different. Going back to Tentacle Outpost. Will there be anything tentacool about Tentacle Outpost? Can I talk to you? Still can't. Oh, Marie's gone. Where's Marie at? Marie? She's not like over here, is she? Cause sometimes she'll spawn over here. She's gone. What's the deal? Where'd she go? And it's not like she just didn't have the chance to spawn. She's just seriously not here anymore. Oh, now I'm curious. Maybe she's back at Ingobble Square. Where, where could she go? I'm not really sure. Uh, no, she's back there now. I guess it was maybe just like an issue where it just didn't spawn her in, because now she's just here and she's just gonna sloop back in. Yep, okay, I think that's where we're gonna finish things off for now though. Stay tuned soon though, because I'll be doing more, of course, ranked mode. We'll be showing off more weapons. We'll be doing more Salmon Run. When that's available, it's not available today, unfortunately, which stinks, because I'm really in the mood for more Salmon Run. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Splatoon 2. If you want to support the video, make sure you comment bonus zebra, starting if watching the video, and you are a zebra-tastic viewer. If you enjoyed this video, and you want to see more like it, feel free to click on any of the videos on your screen right now, or subscribe to join the zebra herd. Either way, Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.